start with a power chord on the 12th fret, which is an E, and we're going to play that power chord twice. And then right after that, we're going to roll our ring finger over and also kind of aim for the D and G string. So we've got... Then back to the power chord. Then the same double stop, but we're rolling our index over to get the, the D and the G on the 12th fret. So when you put those together... So that last one, you're doing the double stop here, but then you're playing the 12th fret on the G string by itself with a lot of uh, vibrato. So you put that together real slow. One more time. Finally, a little cascading thing there, and you have your ring finger on the 14th fret of the D string, and your middle finger is a half step below it, your index a half step below that, and you just, with one pick, and just practice that super slow. In fact, practice the whole riff super slow. an awesome fun riff to play to add to your bag of licks okay so next we're gonna do a C power chord and I'm gonna do it right here on the third fret of the A string fifth of the D and we're gonna go so we've got one two three four five six seven eight, eight. so that would be the fifth up to the sixth the 6th fret root, then a C power chord, which is the 8th fret root, and then F, G, which we're going to, from right here on the 8th fret, we're going to move it over to the A string and D string, and we're going to play that and slide it. And that's what that guitar player is doing. So the chorus would be. All right, let me recap all the parts we've got. 